Bali should be on everyone's bucket list at least once. This paradise on Earth is made up of an enormous diversity of wildlife, breathtaking scenery, and fascinating architecture. Whether you're looking for a relaxing beach getaway, a thrilling off-the-beaten-path adventure, or a shopping binge, this island has something to offer everyone. Hello viewers, and welcome to our channel, Hotspot Traveling. In this video, we'll explore some of the most captivating tourist places to visit and the exciting things to do in Bali. So without further ado, let's dive into the video and don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. So here are our top 10 Bali attractions for 2023. Number 10, Tana Lot Temple. Bali's Tana Lot Temple, which rests on a large rock in the water, is a popular site. Tana Lot Temple is one of Bali's Pura Sagara Seven Sea Temples. Each temple is built so that it can be seen from the next. This creates a spiritual link all over the island. The temple, devoted to sea guardian spirits and built in the 1600s, is claimed to be guarded by fearsome sea serpents. You can walk to the Tana Lot Temple during low tide, but high tide covers it almost completely. A rock-cut staircase allows priests to bless visitors in the sanctuary after dusk. Visit the Holy Water Cave and Coastal Waterfall below the temple to get the most out of your trip. Number 9. Tanjung Banoa As you may or may not know, Bali is a great place to go if you want to kick back and enjoy the beach. However, Tanjung Banoa is the spot to go for thrilling water sports, like all the island's beaches. Tanjung Banoa's shoreline, with its white sand and blue waters, is yet another sight to behold in this Bali paradise. Visitors and locals go there to sunbathe and do water sports. Rides include banana boats, donut boats, and fly fishing. Number 8. Nusa Dua Paragliding The best swimming beach, five-star resorts, a Bali water sports center, and a Tranquil Stay International Airport is 20 minutes from Nusa Dua. The Bukit Peninsula in southern Nusa Dua has many hidden beaches behind the cliffs. On top of the cliff is the Timbis Flying Site, which is the first and safest place to paraglide. Since 1995, the best place to paraglide in Nusa Dua has been at the Timbis Flying Site, which has long flight lines and several hidden beaches. Tandem paragliding in Bali lets you visit Timbis Beach, Gunung Payung Beach, Pandawa Beach, and Malasti Beach. Paragliding with a tandem pilot is a fun and memorable way to add to your trip to Bali. It's easy to join a tandem paragliding flight without instructions, a dress code, or advanced experience. Number 7. Ulun Danu Temple. This beautiful temple and its surroundings reflect Balinese history, culture, and spirituality. Water Temple Ulun Danu means lake beginning. Hindus believe the directional temple protects Bali from bad spirits. Stupas, or burial mounds, greet visitors. The lakeside Pura Teratai Bang Temple has a dark tiered roof and garden. Explore the four god and goddess temples. Penataran Pukak Mangu Temple worships Vishnu, Terate Bang Brahma, Dalem Purwa Danu, and Linga Petak Siva. The temple rite is performed twice a year, but the Pakalam ceremony is done as needed. Bring a jacket to this 4,000 foot high Bali area. The lake is public, so rent a boat for photography or fishing with locals. Bedugul's Ulun Danu Temple is 50 kilometers north of Denpasar. Bedugul has minibuses. Number 6. Ubud Monkey Forest. Ubud's Padangtegal community owns the Monkey Forest. Visit Monkey Forest Temple. Many pagodas, pavilions, and temples are reproductions of mid 14th century ruins. The largest structure, Dalem Agung Temple, performs daily rituals. The Holy Bathing Temple cleans, whereas the Prajapati Temple holds funerals. Learn about macaques in the wild. Over 600 people live in four villages. Monkeys and buildings are important in Balinese Hinduism, which mixes animism, Buddhism, and death worship. Don't feed the cheeky monkeys and keep your valuables safe. Cremation rituals use banyan leaves and pulaban dock masks. Ubud Monkey Forest opens daily. It's walkable from Ubud. It's walkable from Ubud. Parking is free. Number 5. Alas Haram. Haram Bali is the perfect addition to any trip to Bali. It is only 20 minutes from the center of Ubud. Surrounded by verdant vegetation, this intriguing location is ideal for capturing picture-perfect Instagram moments that will make your friends green with envy. Guests can swing, zipline, or ride a sky bike among the stunning terraced rice fields. You might also try the exotic Luwak coffee if you're in the mood for a more relaxing beverage. 
guests will have the rare chance to learn about and try Luwak coffee, which is often thought to be one of the most expensive coffees in the world. In addition to these things to do, Alas Harambali guests can go to Kretya Ubud, a great restaurant that serves breakfast, lunch, and dinner, which are all delicious. Number 4. Bali Water Park When you're ready for a break from the beach or the jungle, make your way to Waterbomb for a day filled with heart-pumping activities like splishing and splashing. A visit to this water park, which has received multiple accolades and has been hailed as the best in all of Asia, is a memorable experience for the whole family, including the grown-ups. It features a variety of rides, including kid-friendly splash pools, tandem race slides, and even the dizzyingly high climax, which shoots you down through a vertical trapdoor, not for the faint of heart. After spending the day diving face-first down the twin racers, rocketing your way down the boomerang, and spiraling through the pipeline, number three, Volcano Hike. In Bali, there are many reasons to get up early, but one of the most iconic is to watch the sunrise from the peak of Mount Batur. This climb of 1,717 meters in altitude can be completed in around two hours. If you want to start the climb before it gets light, you should hire a local guide because the trail will be completely dark and have parts with steep, loose ground. Starting at 2 a.m. and ending at 12.30 p.m., the tour will take you all over the city. The tour includes transportation to and from your hotel, as well as a breakfast of boiled eggs with domi and a view of the sunrise, which is a sight to behold. Number 2. Nusa Penega With so many islands, Indonesia can count itself among the lucky ones. Astoundingly, you may choose from more than 17,000 islands in Indonesia, with Nusa Penida being among the most picturesque of them all. Getting to Nusa Penida from Bali takes no more than 30 minutes on a ferry. A day trip from Bali will get you to this natural beauty, but you'll wish you could have remained longer. Crystal Bay, a beach fringed with palm trees, Atu Beach, and the Thousand Islands viewpoint, all of which offer breathtaking vistas, are just a few of the island's many highlights. If you're looking for a memorable Bali experience, a trip to Nusa Penida should be at the top of your list. Number 1. Chase Waterfalls Ailing Waterfall is a dramatic 35-meter twin fall in Bali's north. The force of it isn't good for swimming, but it's beautiful in pictures. The three additional waterfalls in the region are Bali's natural water park, where you can leap from cliffs and ride rock slides. Kroya Waterfall is a good start. Before sliding down the falls, beginners can warm up on the 5-meter leap. The natural slide is 10 meters long and almost vertical, so you should be ready to dive in quickly. A 10-meter double fall jump is at Kembar Waterfall. We hope our list will help you plan a wonderful getaway to Bali. Please like the video if you enjoyed it and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. Until then, goodbye.